we seek to seek the coming of the King. Welcome to the King's House Assembly International. The Bible said, beware of dogs. So there are those who will discourage you. Your faith will be tried. And those who will try your faith, the, those who the devil will use to try your faith, are those the same in the body, in the, in the household. Remember, there is nowhere the children of God gather, the devil does not gather there. And what does he do? You know, to make sure that those who open themselves up, he will come into their heart. Brothers and sisters, my sisters, my brothers here, don't open your life for the devil to come in. That's why he said, my beloved brethren, my beloved brethren, be unmovable, always be steadfast, abiding in God's work, knowing that your labor of love is not in vain. You see, when discouragement comes, he doesn't tell you that it's against the blessings that comes your way. That man or that woman that his life is discouraging you, trying to get you discouraged, run away from him. He's an agent sent to, this, to, the, to take away your blessings from you. Whatever that makes you discouraged from serving God, you have just opened yourself for the devil. Jesus said to Peter, he said, the devil has entered into you, but I have prayed for you. So, so if the devil can enter into Peter so don't think that the devil can enter into you hallelujah that's why you see some people very zealous serving God but just something happened you know they would throw back what happened the devil has suddenly entered into their lives and they are now dancing to the tunes of the devil you cannot be wiser than the Holy Ghost he said not slothful in business fervent in spirit so you must you must recharge your spirit always. Get in tune with the things of God. Otherwise, you'll be knocked off the line. Otherwise, don't get yourself to be knocked off. Hallelujah. John chapter 12, verse 26. The Bible said, If any man serve me, let him follow me. And where I am, there shall also my servant be if any man serve him let him if any man serve me he will my father honor praise God Jesus said if any man serve me let him follow me and where I am there shall also my servant be if any man serve me he will my father honor can the church say amen we are expected to serve make sure you're doing something for god one day it all will be played for us to see we will all see the works that we've done time is coming that we all be played for us to see so serve God well and be consigned about his things. Don't be less consigned. Now, when you are consigned about things of God, certainly God will prosper you. God opens door for his children, those whose hearts are dear to him. Praise the Lord. In Mark chapter 9, verse 35, the Bible said. And he sat down and called the twelve and said unto them, If any man desire to be first, the same shall be the least of all and serve as servant of all. And so if you desire big position, big responsibility, or you have a big request, what do you want God to be done? You know, sometimes we come to church always looking for what God will do for us. Jesus is saying, if you desire to have, be first, have first position, then you must be a servant. So service is important. You and I is called to serve in the house of God. And so what we are doing in the house of God is important. What is our work in God's house? You know, we sing this song, though we are many, but we are of one body. 
hallelujah so we encourage one another standing by one another watching over one another being one another's keeper don't be too big to look after your brother or sister don't become too proud don't get yourself to a place where you you feel you are too high that you cannot come down low to talk to your brothers and sisters brother don't get to that level he said the devil has come into you but i have prayed for you hallelujah